Governor Laura Kelly's renewed push for Medicaid expansion already facing skepticism from some Republicans. It says the governor's budget was outlined today. Sean Logging has a look at some of the items the governor is proposing this next budget cycle. The proposed budget focuses on the five priorities Governor Laura Kelly laid out in her State of the State Address Wednesday night. That includes Medicaid expansion, tax cuts, child care, education, and water. Now, her budget combines both one-time and ongoing spending. There's about $56 million to support child care efforts. The governor is also calling for a five-year phase-in of special education funding with about $75 million a year in increases. The governor is also recommending an additional $35 million for the state's water plan fund. Medicaid expansion is also part of this pitch. Some Republicans pushing back on that idea. We get to Medicaid because we're also showing that when in these expansion states that we are displacing currently eligible low-income mothers, children, disabled, low-income elderly are being displaced by an able-bodied population. On the Medicaid side, uh, I respectfully don't agree uh, with your position that it displaces a position uh, from somebody currently on there. Uh, we are adding 150,000 people to the roles and not removing anybody from the roles as a result of that. So I, I, I guess we have a difference. No, God, Senate President Ty Masterson says he does see areas of agreement with the governor when it comes to things like water and higher education. While this is the governor's recommended budget, the legislature will now start working on one of its own and the two branches will need to work together to try to find something they can agree on. At the State House, Sean Logging, 12 News. Why is the governor recommending a 5% pay, uh, pay bump and a $15 an hour minimum wage? About a thousand state employees make less than 15 bucks an hour right now. Tonight at six, we take a look at some of the one-time funding that the governor is proposing. That includes plans for the Hutchinson Correctional Facility and funding for the World Cup.